Okay, this video is going to be about turning on power and booting up the Pi. Now, first of all, don't start the power right away. People want to plug in the power right away. Do not. So the first thing I'm going to do is plug in the TTL serial cable. It shows up as before at COM13. It won't always necessarily show up at the same COM port, so always look to see. So now, I open PuTTY. Again, switch this to serial. Switch this to COM13. And change this to, as before, 115200. And open it. So now PuTTY is open. Now, so here's the power cable. Even though it's switched, it's switched off. But again, I'm going to connect it. I'm going to connect it before I've connected power. The power connection on the Pi Zero is the micro USB at this end, right on the end. So we plug that in there, like that. Now I'm going to plug in the power supply over here. The switch, I have it switched off, I think. So I'm going to plug it in here now. And it's off. Now when I switch it on, you will see the active light start to flash as it boots up. So you see that it's now booting up. And now if you watch over here, when it gets to a certain point in the boot process, you will start to see activity here. So that's communicating. It takes about a minute to boot up. It'll be finished booting up when it gets to the prompt that asks you for the login. So again, it looks like it's stalled. It isn't. There we get to login. It may take longer than that. So the login is pi. The password is raspberry. There we go. So we're in. And if we do an ls, that will list our files. And we see that there are no files there. So that's it. Now to shut down, I type in sudo shut down, all one word. Oops. Dash H, which means halt, which means to shut down. Now, if you do a dash R, that will reboot it. Dash H means to stop it. And now means to do it right away. I hit enter. Now again, it says power down. You look at the light on there that's flashing. When that light stops flashing and goes off, it's powered down. So now you can turn it off. And you always want to shut it down properly before you turn it off. And now it's okay to shut close putty and unclose. Connect that if you want. 